it's so easy to get beat down in this line of work. But today we have a real cause for hope because Earl and I are on our way to bring a young puppy named Reagan to her potential new home. Don't be scared. You're getting bailed out. You're getting bailed out. Tanya handled the meet and greet, and she did a really great job in helping pick out this little puppy to be a companion for their existing dog, Luke. You know, sometimes puppies can get a little overwhelmed by larger dogs. So, of course, you know, we're hoping that Lou is going to be okay with Reagan on his home turf. You about to go to your home, little girl. We are terribly excited. We've been looking forward to this, and um, we're hoping it's a great fit for everybody. Hi. 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 Oh, look at you. You look pretty. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, we got you, bud. Oh. So we meet again. Kisses. Oh, now you want to start perking up now? <laughs> what do you think? Oh, look at her. No, yeah. We couldn't even get her to walk a minute ago. Hey, would you let, would you let, hold on a second here? <laughs> yeah. All right, well, that's your bud. Go ahead and go in then. Come on, lead the way. We've already been to this home for Lou's adoption, so I already know that it's a great place for a dog. You want to go show her the yard? Oh, this is cute back here. But I still need to see how these two get along on Lou's territory. I had was get you, Lou boy. I had was get you. Cute, so cute. To see Reagan being the one, you know, doing the play bow and initiating all the play, it just shows me that she is super comfortable and just feels really good about her new surroundings. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, I got this uh, oh. Oh. I got you. I win. Oh, God, they're so cute together. Two puppies is definitely different than one puppy. Oh, they're going to have so much fun. I feel that we are ready for the work. Um, we're looking forward to raising two dogs that are close to an age. Well, this was easy peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> All right, Mr. Earl, you ready to head back? I think she done found her forever. Yes, home. she did. With a big brother. Yeah. What's her, um, Brother from another mother. Mm -hmm. Brother from another mother. Yeah. It couldn't have gone any better. I think they were both really happy to see each other again, and settling into our new home life is going to be good for both of them. Thank you. Thank you so Amy, much. You need to give us a call. Thank you. Thanks. Lou and Reagan were both strays at the Assumption Parish Jail slash animal shelter. You know, they both came from the same, you know, hood, and, um, you know, it feels like it was meant to be, and we couldn't ask for anything more than that. After a few days on the road, we finally arrived in Boston. We made a few wrong turns, so it's too dark now to do the yard and home checks, so we'll be doing it first thing in the morning. But the adopters, Eric and Jacqueline, were so excited, they couldn't wait until the next day. So they wanted to meet us at a highway stop so they could meet us cargo. Hi. I'm Tanya. I'm Jacqueline. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Nice to meet you. I'm Jacqueline Blankenberg. My husband's Eric. We're hound lovers. Beagles are our favorite breed. On Facebook, I saw S. Cargo's picture and a little bit of his story, and something spoke to me, and I said, oh, gee, I would love to have him. <laughs> this is the S. B. S. Cargo. <laughs> <laughs> He's really cute, huh? <laughs> I wanted to cry, like I filled up a little bit seeing him and we love our dogs like they're kids, so I felt like we could give him a good home. <laughs> he has so much personality, it's insane. I know that we'll give him a very good home. Um, the three that we already have, I mean, we spoil rotten and I think he's gonna be wonderful. I'm so excited for him. He's one of the, the greatest dogs. He really is. He is really, really, really so special. Sweet. I can't promise that I'm not going to get emotional, but I'll try to keep it together. <laughs> I'm even more excited for him now, like after meeting you guys. He was what you expected, at least? Oh, yeah. More? Yeah. yeah. More. <laughs> <laughs> the second they saw S Cargo, they melted. I really hope that everything works out tomorrow because S Cargo deserves to have his own home. All right, Cargo pants. Bye, Cutie. It's going to be the last step of his journey of finding his forever home. Last night, we met S Cargo's potential adopters, Jacqueline and Eric. 
Uh, we got to Boston later than we had planned, but thankfully they fell in love with us cargo. <laughs> Hi! So we're finally at S. Cargo's potential home so he can meet their three dogs. This neighborhood is beautiful. Yeah, it's really nice. You never really know what's gonna happen when you introduce two dogs, and especially in their own homes. Hi! Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I've grown up around dogs, but mainly pit bulls. And pit bulls aren't big barkers, but since we've moved to the south, we've taken on a lot of hounds, and I've been hearing a lot more of that big hound howl. Oh my gosh. Hi. Hi, baby. This is the best ever. This is so cute. <laughs> Maybe all the howling was because they were excited to meet a new dog. We'll introduce out front. Okay. Um, probably just one at a time. Okay, come on. Uh, we like to introduce dogs on neutral territory first so they don't get territorial. We didn't introduce the three and S Cargo all at once. We just did one at a time just because we didn't want to make S Cargo too overwhelmed. <laughs> come on, come on. Let's go meet your new friend. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. Take them on a walk. <laughs> Take them on a walk together. Okay. First, we walked S Cargo and their dog Yates, and it seemed they were fine. Tails were wagging, and everything was great. He's really good with other dogs. <laughs> Let's just start like walking. You know, does it have to even be a, a meet? Yeah, we'll just go. After Yates worked out so well, we decided to grab their dog Abby and take the three of them on a walk together, and that worked out great too. He's really good. He is really good. Friend next. You guys are all friends now. But their dog, Bella, she's kind of the queen bee, and she isn't always the most welcoming dog. Come on, let's go for a walk. You're excited. I was really surprised right away. She seemed to welcome S. Cargo. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that was all of them, right? Yep. OK. <laughs> this is so nice. This is like so cute, all of them walking together. He fits right this in. so funny to me. You just made three new friends in one day. It's really emotional to see Oscar go walking down the street with his three new beagle friends because the first time I saw him, I didn't know if he was going to survive. I feel like they're just going to be the coolest dogs in the neighborhood, all of these guys together. Beagle gang? Yeah, <laughs> the beagle gang. <laughs> How fun. <laughs> Sometimes dogs can act differently on their own territories. So I just wanted to make sure that all three dogs were as accepting of S Cargo in their own yard. Come on. Party it up. This is the funniest thing I've ever seen. Yeah. Luckily, they all just wanted to play, and everybody seemed to be getting along. Hi. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Go play. They're really cute together. Escargo seemed really, really happy. I couldn't have picked a, a more perfect home for him. <laughs> this is so cute. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. The only thing that's left is to make it official. Oh, yeah, he's very, very playful. Thinking about the stuff he had been through and to be here and healthy, and I, I just feel like he's meant to be with us and our family. Before we brought him here, we were actually just, you know, looking through some of the pictures of, you know, what he looked like before, and it was, like, really difficult to see, but he's so happy. This is amazing. There's a reason why he made it, and he can spread as much love and joy to everybody, and I think he's, he's going to be wonderful. It's a happy little family, and I couldn't be more excited, so.